Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new, welcome. So today I'm going to be reacting to another Eurovision entry and this time it's to, it's a very big one, the United Kingdom. So of course the UK is going to be represented by Ollie Alexander this year which is absolutely incredible. The fact that such a big star is representing the UK. We never thought it would happen a few years ago so it's fantastic already. Now this song was released at midnight last night and I did listen to it. I couldn't help myself. After that teaser he dropped I was like I need to listen to this as soon as possible. But of course I wasn't going to react to it at midnight. I think it's going to do much better than people expect. The music video for Dizzy has just dropped, so I'm going to give it a watch. This is the point, I never really fall in love with a song until I see the visuals for it. So, let's watch the music video. I love the effect here. Nice sepia colours. I really like the beat of this. And once again, the UK had a budget for its music video. Are they going to bring a house on stage? They could. Make me dizzy from your kisses. Yeah, it's great. I do see them bringing a turning platform on stage. I kind of hope they don't and do something a bit different. Like with the camera angles create that dizzy spinning effect. But this is very Ollie Alexander. That's quite interesting actually. I like the jumping across. One thing I will say. I do think the verse is too short. Now I do see this as a song that could come top 5 if they get the staging completely right. The BBC is not going to be going half hearted with this. Um, there's a big, big budget for this and you can already tell with this music video. I love that speaking part as well. That's really effective actually. You could now get the boxes down from the ceiling from the stage for that bit, recreate it. So, that is the UK's entry for Eurovision this year. I really do see it coming top 10. Personally, I really like it. I know it's not going to be everyone's taste to feel like Ollie's always had that divisiveness about him. But as I say, now that I've seen the visuals for it, I like it even more. You can see kind of aspects of what they could do with the staging. Um, it just, it makes it much more exciting when you see the visuals. And... I'm looking forward to a live performance and then it's just going to build. This is a quality act. A few years ago we would never imagine that Ollie Alexander and Dizzy would be representing us. Or, like, just be happy. So that's what I think of the UK song for Eurovision this year. Let me know what you think about it in the comments down below. Also don't forget to give this video a like and if you're new click that subscribe button. It means a lot to me if you do. And I will see you again for another Eurovision reaction video soon. Bye.